Hi, it's uh, Kevin May, the Editor-in-Chief of Focuswire here uh, in the Focuswire studio. David Trastu, you're the Head of Video Solutions at Amadeus. And it says here, you're introducing the industry's first content management and distribution solution for personalized media. Explain. Explain. Please. Sure. Hi. Um, basically, what we're doing is very simple. We're providing an all-in-one um, system, which is cost-effective, mm -hmm. um, marketing solution for the travel industry. Okay. So in a nutshell, what we do is we, we take your content, your pictures and your videos, and we allow you to enrich them, make them interactive uh, with information, with calls to action, with live fairs, um, and you can publish them anywhere. So you can um, publish them uh, directly to consumers, so on your website, newsletters, etc. And you can distribute them, and that's really where we, we come in, especially as Amadeus, uh, throughout a resellers, travel resellers, such as travel agencies. You know, we have 92,000 travel agencies. So the intention here is to take that content and to allow, you know, if it's a hotel content or DMO content, to allow a travel agent to leverage that content to, re to reuse it. And the third thing we do is we track end-to-end -end, uh, so that we, you know, if you publish your, um, your videos and pictures on your websites or through travel agencies to provide really an aggregated view Okay. about uh, the usage of this content. Is it mostly going to be hotels? I in, terms, in, in terms of, yeah, the, the, the content, we're thinking about uh, TMOs because they have tons of fantastic content, really inspirational content, yeah. uh, videos, very rich. We're thinking about, obviously, hotels, uh, but also tour operators, cruises. They have, you know, very inspirational content yeah. as well. So this would be the, the, the main, the main uh, domains so on the agency desktop, that's where that's its primary so, end place, is it then? It could be. It could be indeed the. Uh, it could be the website if they have a small website, depending on the yeah. size of the agency. But it could be uh, their website. It could be their Facebook. It could be obviously in store uh, on their desktop. We actually, we also run a. Uh, we have an Apple TV application. So maybe if they have uh, a TV in the store, they could use that there. Um, it could be on the proposals, you know, maybe, or in a newsletter, or, you know, you, instead of just sending usually the proposal that they do right. to customers or, you know, uh, text, well, you can make them multimedia now. Okay. Um, yeah. When it's on the agency desktop, of offline re uh, retail agency, at what point does these, is this video content or media content being shown? Is it the, you know, the classic places you get into the travel agency and they turn the screen around and they say, oh, these are the places that you can go. Is it dotted around there? Is, is that, is that the, so, po the point in that kind of journey that it goes through? Or is it a little bit further on or where? So today, that would, yeah, indeed, that the experience of, of, of the agent turning a screen is, that's it's a reality, that's what it is. Yeah. Uh, we, we are thinking about, um, it's not today, it doesn't exist, but we're thinking about uh, even providing like a, a tablet application uh, so that, you know, you literally hand over uh, that okay. to, the, to the customer and show the media in this way. Um, so we were thinking about all, you know, different in-store experience, either it's through like a, having a TV or a tablet, but you know, more interactive and, and yeah, not the turning of your screen experience, which is not ideal. <laughs> well, really. Maybe that says a lot more about the last time I went into a travel agency, I have to confess. But they did oh, but too. It's, it still exists. It, it does still exist. So um, will, will this be available on online travel agency partners as well? For sure. Um, so we, ha we have a number of pilots with, uh, with uh, online travel agencies. Well, in that case, they're not necessarily interested in the distribution aspect, uh, but literally just in the technology. So taking their, their content, uh, videos and photos, and enrich them. So uh, also you can brand the player. So it becomes your video player instead of using, you know, I don't want to name, uh, uh, con you know, uh, alternative solutions, but there's a instead of using YouTube or uh, something like that, okay. you can really have your own video player with interactive content, prices, your prices, and so yeah. it's a lot more engaging. That, that you kind of preempted my next question. Is that, I mean, who do you consider your competitors to be? Is it YouTube and Instagram, or is it no, stuff it's, that's in-house in the it's industry? It's a very different, it's a very different um, um, goal. I mean, YouTube is great for, uh, for to promote your brand, right? So you want to be there, you want to have a channel, you want to you know, promote your brand. Mm -hmm. uh, YouTube is not necessarily the best tool in terms of lead generation. Um, and this is where we, we came in. We, yeah. you know, we, once, once people are on your site, they're interested in mm -hmm. something, you want to keep them engaged and stay on the site and not go somewhere else. And that's where yeah. we, we really come in. So lead generation is the, the key goal here. So Amadeus is a media company now as well, then, is it? 
for sure. And we have, you know, we now have different uh, different offers in the in the media space. We have travel audience, which is advertising. Yeah. Uh, we have video. Uh, we have media solutions, which is also advertising on the GDS. Mm -hmm. Now we have video solutions, and through Travel Click, we also have uh, a media play yeah. uh, with hotels. So you know. In terms of organization, is a separate organization, but it's clear that something is emerging in terms of um, advertising and marketing. Yeah. Okay, David Trester, thank you very much. Thank, thank you, you very much. Thanks.